Transaction diamond scenario with the session bin in Jakarta Enterprise bin no EJB. Here you can see transaction diamond scenario with the session bin. While it is illegal for two clients to access the same session object, it is possible for applications uh, uh, that use session beans to encounter the diamond case. Uh, for example, the program A start with, uh, starts a transaction and then invokes two different session objects. Uh, if the session object bean instances, instances cache the same data item, for example, current balance of account 100, um, across method invocations in the same transaction, most likely the program is going to produce incorrect results. The problem may exist uh, regardless of whether the two session objects are the same or different session beans. Uh, the problem uh, may exist and may be harder to discover if the, there are intermediate objects between the transaction initiator and the session object that cache the data. Uh, there are no requirement for session container provider be, uh, for the container provider because it is impossible for container to detect this problem. Uh, the bean provider and application assembler must avoid creating applications that would result an in inconsistent caching of data in the same transaction by multiple session objects. Here you can see a program may is connected to uh, session instance one via TX1 uh, uh, and pro program A is connected to session instance 2 via TX1 here. Session instance, instance 1 and session instance 2 are inside enterprise bean container. Session instance 1 is connected to read and cache account 100. Uh, sorry, session instance 1 is connected to database via read and cache account 100 here and session instance 2 is connected to database via read and cache account 100 here. Now, uh, this is the uh, end of my presentation. Thank you very much for watching it.